Welcome back to CEO 2023. We have now reached the late night hours and we have a special KOF exhibition coming for you. 5v5 Mexico versus Peru. I am Cookie and I'm joined by... Your boy, PAG Virgo. <laughs> you're, you're a game lead for KOF 15. We just finished. It was a great event. I mean, matches out the wazoo. Yeah. I mean, it was super amazing. So it was, I mean, if you didn't watch it, go check the VODs. Please go check the but VODs. But after this exhibition. Well, watch yes, the exhibition definitely. first because this is going to be good. Yes, yes. But I think, uh, I don't know if our players are ready on the stage or if our MC is ready because we have a special guest in Max Powers, quote unquote. <laughs> my, my favorite Max Powers impression and the only Max Powers impression I know. Um, but we will have that ready for you soon. Yeah, so okay. to the house mic with my boy Data D-Wang. <laughs> hey guys, <laughs> thanks for waiting. I know you waited long. So, here's the deal. We got Team Mexico versus Team Peru. Now, I know last year we had, I believe, Team Mexico versus Team Brazil. Yeah. I think you might recognize some of the players on Team Mexico. So, we have Wero, Asamiya, <laughs> Gummy, Kitsune971, Sace MX, and because he did so well last year, they've decided to draft F. Kang into Team Mexico. <laughs> now, representing Team Peru, we have Dante, Kusa, Yuri Kof, Chino Funky, and because they only had four representatives, we also added Rocklin Keo from Colombia, who will also represent Team Peru. So, without further ado, I believe the players are coming up. We have Wero Asamiya versus Rocklin Kyo. Ooh, oh, it's a good match. Got right off the bat. We're yeah, I mean, uh, funny enough, um, off stream earlier, while you were playing your sets, uh, Mexico and Peru actually did a small, like, 3v3 exhibition. Okay. Uh, it was Sace, Gummy, Wero versus Chino, Yuri Cobb, and Kusa. Um, so I'm excited to see, I mean, players are warmed up, obviously. They've been playing all day after top eight. Mm. Literally top eight finished at what, 2 p.m.? I come in here at eight o'clock and they're literally just playing games over yeah. and over and over. Yeah. See, I like the th one thing I like about them is that they don't mind like playing for a long period of time. Most people just don't try to avoid playing people so they, you know, they get used to their play style. But, you know, for them, it's just like, you know, if, if you're good, you know, you know what, what exactly you need to do uh, against your opponent. Sometimes they switch it up, you know, may, may find little tricks here and there, you know, to kind of get a one up on them. But, you know, they just constantly keep playing. And, and that's the beauty about King of Fighters 15. You know, these are dedicated players. You know, they love the game and they always come and show out, you know, um, at these events. Yeah, I mean, they really do. It was funny enough, uh, I was having a conversation uh, with Yurikov earlier uh, and the ages of some of these players came up. Uh, and you'd be shocked to know that several of the Peruvians, uh, and I think even Rockle and Keo, they're in their 40s. Oh, okay. These dudes are like, you know, family men, just mm -hmm. KOF all the time. So yeah. dedicated to their craft. Most of the Mexicans are like in their mid to late 30s. Yes. Like they are going on, on some high numbers here and they're still playing KOF to this day. Mm. Yeah, that's true dedication, you know, just like uh, Street Fighter players as well, you know. It's very rare that you see, um, I don't believe Tekken also, you know, has some, but mostly are like young boys, you know, yeah. like they're, they're, they're very young. But uh, I would say it's very rare that you'll see some young uh, players in KOF. You know what I mean? There's some here and there, but I mean, KOF is such a good game. It's, it's well versed. You know, there's a, a, a range of characters that you can pick, you know, uh, different styles for you to choose, you know. So if you want to zone, you want to do rushdown, uh, you want to do mix-ups, you know. It's, it's just so much flavor in this game. Yeah, they're, they're, it, it's, uh, it's pretty great. And I mean, it's really easy to switch between characters because of how well the system gels with how each character's kit yep. is built out. Yep. But I think we're ready to go into our first game. Wedo Asamiya versus Rockling Kyo. I have no idea as to the rules of this 5v5, genuinely. So I, as far as I know, they're just gonna go after each other. What a jump! Oh, wow. hey, Rockland is already starting off. 
<laughs> and then here comes Vero with the aggressive Joy. Oriori. Bop, bop. Yes, yes. Get the Oki. What oh, a DP! Yeah, both of these players seasoned. Both of these players, I have no idea how much uh, training they have against one another. Uh, yeah, you're dead. All I know is uh, Rocklin Keo in top eight today, he was showing up. Yeah. Top 24 yesterday, especially. The Shuni 8, not a common character, but almost anime esque uh, in how his kit is now built nowadays. And I mean, I definitely saw Rocklin Keo open up quite a few people in top eight earlier. Yeah. They are not touching each other at all. Yeah. And, uh, I mean, as you can see, they're, they're trying to figure each other out. And then he gets the opening. Oh, yeah, you can't roll that. That's a roll save. You know, try to get away, but he caught him. Oh, he messed up. He didn't believe. He didn't believe. Oh. No! Here we go. Bah! Putting in the word? Oi! Yeah, that's like his one, like, like one of his only good reversals. Alright, we're on to kill now. Ooh, boom, boom. Kill coming out. Half health on the Shunie basically dies in the next hit. But uh, oh, oi, oh. that was a messed up that was a messed up dash cancel. Yo, what a neutral full jump. Oh, no fear. Patience on the throw. Oi! Ooh. Oh, what a <laughs> Yo, what an anti-air yeah. dead chip. Yeah, yeah. I really like uh, Rockland's Keo usage of the, the dash fire fist to like beat people out a bar egg. Mm. Oh, and we get the, the Keo versus Yori theme. Nice DP. Punish, yes. Very negative on block. No EXDP in response to the 2D. Okay. Not dead just yet. Guess per game. Ooh. EX record. What? Maybe he okay. thought jump back? Uh oh. He's dead though. You died. Yeah. Game one or set one or. Oh, he missed! No! What? Oh, no, he no. fucking it on EX that was crazy. Oh, when I was talking to him about how that whiffed. <laughs> yeah, I did. Oh, okay, oh, okay, okay. So we got five predetermined matchups from the players here, and then after that, it becomes Pokemon style, mm. which is a lot of games. That's a lot of games. Yes. So you're gonna get your money's worth. What's it's 10 p.m. We're going to be here a while. We might be here till midnight. <laughs> hey, we're rocking it out just for you guys so you can be entertained, watch this nice exhibition, and just keep going. Yeah. I mean, I'm always down for more KOF, especially uh, from some players that didn't make stream. Yes. Uh, especially, I think Dante is coming up to the stage. Yeah. I don't, I don't know if Dante made a stream or if his pools were off stream, but I personally haven't seen him play yet. Oh, he did make stream. He was in top 24. I'm dumb. I watched him play. Oh, man. my It's late. I'm getting cooked. <laughs> it's over, bro. Hey, hey, we've been here all morning. You know, we, yeah. did, we just did the oh. top eight at 10. Well, 11 11, 11 a.m. top yeah. eight. We are now here almost 12 hours later with yep. more KOF. Yep, yep. Man. If you thought the tournament was over at 11 a.m., you were wrong. Yeah, what a phenomenal weekend. I, I, I'm i just so blown away how good KOF was this weekend. Oh, it was amazing. You know, and, and the crazy thing, some of the, you know, obviously uh, other players as well known, you know, weren't here, but we still had a really good show. Um, so there's definitely some players from out of the, out of the country as well. Um, I would say uh, Kasune, right? Is Kasune from out of the country? I, He's I, like from the Caribbean. Is he? Yeah. That's dope. Yeah. 
I was wondering because I had not uh, I had not seen the name before, and he came through and kind of cooked. Yeah. He made a uh, what ninth place? Mm. I yeah, think it was yeah. What's I think it was ninth place? Yeah, he got uh, uh beat by Gummy. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Gummy yeah. beat him to get into top eight. I and funny enough, he just won a first to ten against F Kang off stream. Ten yeah. nine. Yeah. And Tom Bob's actually almost got the top eight, but he lost to Arslan Ash uh, with that uh, annoying Athena. Yeah. I mean, he was cooking people with Athena, but, you know, shout out to Arslan Ash. Did really well this, this yeah, weekend as well. Yeah, did really, really well. He always constantly placed the top eight. Amazing. All right. Set two coming up. First to ones. I don't know if the point totals mean anything. We're just going to go with it. It's about to be but first to ones, here. two Joes. You don't see that a lot nowadays. Two Joes on either side. Oh, that's a lot of uh, spamming and uh, zoning people out. It's a lot of zoning. <laughs> it is a lot of zoning. And we have Yashiro on one team for no zoning. Mm. Not anymore. Round one. Let's see how well Ready? that uh, non-zoning Yashiro works out, though. Yeah, well, he hits hard, so. He does hit hard. No meter, though? Yeah. Middling? Oh, Yash, though? Maybe. And already half guard. Yo, he's getting his guard bar cooked. Uh, he's yeah, he had the frame trap there. Oh, oh, oh. No, no cancel. All right, all right, he got the hit that time. All right, Dante off to a strong lead. Little drops here and there, but you know, still, it's late. Still good. It's late. We're getting old. Oh, not dead just yet. Oh, I forgot. I, I forgot he could do that mid-screen. Honestly. Ooh. I don't see you don't see this character as much anymore. I honestly forgot that he had that change in the screen. Whoa! He made the other side. Boom! 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 F Kang not out of it just yet. Yo, what a mash! Boom! Dante's trying to open up F Kang. I mean, he's just working on borrowed time at this point. Anything he gets here, oh, extra crash. credit! Big damage, corner route. Yo, the no fear, even against a CD, potentially. Nice rollout. I gotta get out this corner. Time withering down, though. Dante in big control right now. Oh, no, man. he's oh. dead. The big boy butt. Yeah, the third leg button, as I like to refer to it. <laughs> he puts out, he puts out his whole third leg to hit you from behind. Dante, uh, <laughs> potentially a Yashiro CV. Looks like it's gonna happen. Maybe. I mean, the cheese in that fight. The Chizuru is the, the flagship of the F Kang, uh, the F Kang team. So, I mean, the potential reverse OCV is definitely not lost. Joy! No, no, no fear in the DP. I'm a zoner now. Oh, F Kang is holding it down. He put Dante in the corner. And the rushdown is working in his favor right now. He almost perfected him there. Yeah, that was actually in. ridiculous. Now we are on last characters. I mean, the comeback. He did, he did make it. Yeah. Okay. Oh. You're getting climaxed. All right, you lost like 65% immediately, and you're in jail for the next 360 frames. Yo, FK. Woo! He tried it, he tried it. No, 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 no. All right, what, level one? Does he commit to the level two, or do we wait? He commits. All right, big damage. This is a, basically a guess for game scenario, either side. Nice block from FK. Okay, trying to hold down. Oh, this... not holding down. I'm gonna be oh. guard Christ! Let's go, Dante. And Dante taking it in the first to one over F Kang. One one apiece so far. Yeah, it's looking good right now. 
Wow. Next, we have Gummy versus Kusa. Gummy versus Kusa. We saw Kusa. Actually, I think Kusa's, Kusa's was pools were off stream, but he wasn't yeah. top 24. Yeah, he was. So you saw a little of that. Definitely saw Gummy. Made top 8, obviously. Mm -hmm. uh, also top 24, so... I mean, I've uh, I've actually been meaning to watch a little more of Kusa this weekend because yeah. uh, I forget whose pool it was, um, but he kind of like cooked his pool and shocked a lot of people with how well oh, he yeah. played. No, he's good. I mean, we played on the side and he cooked me, so I was just like, oh god, you know. Hey man, listen, I'm all for like people coming through, you know, like if it's their first time here, you know, and you, you know, seeing new players. I, I I love seeing new players. Yeah. You know, because um. I was told that uh, in Mexico, there are some actually players that don't really come out, and they're yeah. actually way better than Rero. And yeah, I've heard it. that a lot too. So I'm, I'm so curious to I mean, we, who we, it is and who we need to fly out. I mean, we still haven't seen in an offline setting, we still haven't seen Reno, still haven't seen Shadow X, still haven't yeah. seen Lokov, still yeah. haven't seen Laic. Yeah, yeah. Like, there's a lot of, there's a lot of players on the. Well, uh, have we seen Aaron Robert? I think he came out to the event yeah. recently. Yeah. Uh, but it's like there's a lot of. There's a lot of players that still haven't set foot on U.S. soil for these majors. Oh, but, yes. but, probably in about a month, the challenger is coming up. Okay. The 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 one week before Mexican like big event, uh, where like KOF is like the mainstay, uh, and that's like where the, all the Mexican players go to play, and then like who's ever visiting Evo to play like uh, say from Asia or Europe or other countries typically go to challenger to get that tournament um, sets before going. Like last year, ZJZ and ET both went to Challenger. Yep. So, I mean, hey, a lot could a lot could happen next month. Oh, man, I can't wait. Now, Kusa versus Gummy. Yashiro Ready? again. Yo, Kusa playing a team, though. Cheezer, Krone, and Jenny. Ooh. I got caught. I got hit, yeah. Always get hit. Out of there. They're playing default colors. Are they? Looks like default. Yeah, it looks like it. Maybe not. Maybe Yashiro looks a little more tan. <laughs> Look like he, looks like he's been going out. Damn, wow. That actually did more damage than I thought. Alright, Rio coming in. A whole lot of Rios this weekend. Yes. Stay down. Gummy putting in work right now. Oh, he is playing with Kusa. Wow. You know, nah, you're cracked. What? <laughs> it is. 10 10 at night, and you hit that? Nah, dog. That's crazy. Oh, nice DP. <laughs> We're just oh. whipping in his face with that close yeah, game. Hey, we just do, we're just playing games with each other, I guess. Definitely trying to fit each other out. Who's playing it slow though? Yep. Oh, he tried to EX projectile. Oh. What do you mean? Just do it. Bro, just it's 10 o'clock at night. You gotta stop. Just do it. Oh no, the empty jump gets eaten alive. Have it back though. You get a cross up off of this. Stay in front. Yeah. Woo! Very well done. The shimmy throw, though. All right, Cronin coming in, three bars. Rio with just about one. CD. Big CD to God. Saw a lot of entrances like this at top eight. The JCD coming in deep. And you're dead. Didn't even need to spend a bar. Gummy saving it for another day. Oh, yeah. Four bars. Four bars means you take like 60% on the next hit. Yep. And then it's a guess for game scenario from there. That's right. Don't get touched. Oh, you got empty load. Oh, here we go. Big damage. Yeah, you guess for game on this next hit. Let's see what you got. Woo! Oh, you got nothing! Gummy takes it. Yeah, that was quick. That was quick. Gummy was yeah. like, 
Gummy's like, Gummy was laying on the floor earlier. Legit just had his head on like a backpack. He's, he was he was cruising. He was just laying down. He didn't care. He's ready to go to bed. Absolutely. He's like, let's get this done right away. Yeah. We don't have no time. Right. No time to get He wants nothing to do with that. Kitsune 971 versus Yurikov. Uh, if most of you know, Yurikov is currently living in the United States, but did represent Peru in yeah. the top eight. Rocking the Peruvian flag as well during top eight. They should, where's the Peruvian flag at? It's Team Peru. There's no <laughs> Mexican flag this year. That's I was so shocked, bro. There is no Mexican flag this year. Yeah, it felt empty because like the whole Mexican crew wasn't here. So uh, yeah, you know. I was surprised. No Mexican flag. There wasn't even a Brazilian flag. They They're, usually bring it every you know every event. So I was surprised they even. Yeah, know, that's what I thought. I was like, this is carried it, carried in their case. But I mean. Peru brought their flag. Peru, Peru came up. Peru got second. Chino yep. Funky putting in work. That was ridiculous. Yeah. They had the whole crowd screaming at some of those some of those things that he did. Yeah. God's like. Again, excellent matches throughout this whole weekend. Yeah. Amazing. And I mean, definitely some players who names uh, whose names aren't as big definitely came up. Yep. And uh, and showed out, which is great. Yep. It's always good to get more people into the game. <laughs> More people on the on the limelight. I mean, hey, I, I assume a lot of people haven't heard of Kitsune before this point. Yeah. So I mean, hey, can't can't co coming through. I mean, I saw that he beat Kang 10-9 in the first of 10. No one else saw it, but I mean, I wouldn't be surprised if he goes toe to toe with Yurikov here. Yeah. He plays a he plays a funky team. He plays like Ryo Yamazaki. <laughs> Uh, and I forget the third. Geese, there it is. It's, and if you really wanted another Rio, we got another Rio. This is like the fourth Rio in a row or something. <laughs> I think he puts you out back. No, he puts up flat. Yeah, Yurikov was actually talking to me um, about his team choices this weekend because he's like, yeah, I played Isla like on stream here and there. He's like, she's just fun. He's like, I didn't play Met and Kun all that, all that much like up until top eight. And I was like, I mean, yeah, but like, he's obviously like your strongest character. Yeah. Obviously. And obviously, like, people don't know how to fight that. Yeah, Isla, was, he, he was cooking with Isla, definitely. Um, I actually have just picked up Isla too, but I'm not playing as good as he is. And it's amazing to see that somebody's taking the time. Yeah, you know, you, Isla hasn't uh, hasn't caught on as much uh, in the states. Catching on a little bit in uh, Latin America. Um, we do have a few Isla representatives. You saw that combo breaker, but Asia is rocking that character. Yeah. So Kasune is off to a good start, especially yeah. with a character that's really highly annoying. Oh. Oh. Oh, wow. oh, what a jump. That's big damage. Not enough to kill. Bro does kill off of this, though. Oh, that jump is scary. You were asking to get DP or air to air. He tried it again. He tried the JD again off of the dive kick. The jump back JD worked the fourth time. Yeah, That's all you need. Yeah, because he did a good job just staying patient. You know, not overextended. Now I gotta deal with all these cross ups. Lulo. Yeah, true. I mean, he got a block. Or oh. or you could be like Weto and just mash on it and actually just anti air it. <laughs> I saw him doing that earlier. He was just mashing on the cross up and anti airing it. I was like, you're better than I. Oh, the oppression in the corner. And we're tied up. Gosh, she's so good. <laughs> <laughs> I just look at this character, it's just like so like screaming rush. Andrew, I know you're watching. This character is good. It's true. She made four. Boom, boom, boom. No super needed. 300 damage. Ooh, I think that was probably on. Negated the quick max mix if there was ever gonna be one. Yeah. Quick sure is a mistake. Go, your car putting Kusune back in the corner. Playing it super slow. Now, Kusune got coughing in the corner. Wow, he didn't even cancel out. 
Might want to save that bar for Yamazaki. Yeah. Oh! Ooh. It might come back to bite him, though. Yeah. Alright. Stand Throw up. Throw down. Definitely gonna come back to bite him. Not gonna yeah. get a lot of health back. Oh, this round and the counter. Yo, throw, throw on either side. Anything kills, anything kills. Jump back, JD. Jump back, fireball. Jump back, yeah. JD. Yeah. Soon is done. He's Dude. looking for a jump back. Something. Yeah. Got the grounded fireball. Wow. Yeah, he's regretting it. Should have killed him when you had the chance. Should. I mean, hey, I've been saying that. We saw people do that in top eight. Set that meter to kill. Oh, oh yeah. That oh, that's a little, a little, too, a little too happy with those fireballs. Down to last character each. A lot of bar on Yuri Cop's side. But Yamazaki can deal it back in spades, having some really high one bar damage. Oh, we missed it. Didn't matter. Still has corner. Plus frames. Get out the corner. Stay in the corner. Wake up, DP. I got it. Now you're back in the other corner. I mean, what a 2C. So much bar to go around. Oh, we go. We're going to spend it. That's big damage. He actually might be dead. Looks like it. He's going to be very close. He's actually going to be really close. Oh! 10 HP in the anti air snake arm. Katsune takes it over oh, Yurikov. Well done. <sighs> That's super. <sighs> that combo. <sighs> uh, Yo, 10 HP, one, one, one more poison tick, tick, and that would have been a dead you know character. That's, going on, Will it that's kill. crazy, but that was, that was well, well done. Well done by True. Finally, Someone submit last, that to Will it Kill. Sace, yeah. Amex versus Chino Funky. Yeah, we got Sace, oh, who did not make funky. top eight, Yes. who lost to Coach Steve, going up against... Yeah, that big, big upset, big that upset. Big Going upset. against uh, the second place, Chino Funky. Also, this shirt is dope. <laughs> Got it right before the camera cut. Hey. All right. Oh, my God. Please submit that to Will It Kill. That was very, that was, whew. That caught me off guard. Yeah, man, I'm excited to see how this goes. Uh, Sace was doing all right in the exhibitions I watched earlier. Okay. I'll, I, can, I can only say all right because I only saw him play like one game. Yeah. And then he, seemed, he seemed kind of down yeah. about to his loss. He definitely was surprised about the loss. I mean, hey, you know, coach just played Chino, better. Chino put him in losers first, right? Yeah. Yeah, so Chino put him, uh, put says in losers, and then Coach Steve finished the job by, you know, eliminating him from yep. the tournament. Steve just played better. Yeah. That's all that's all that's all that yeah. you can uh that's all that you can say. Yeah. And I'm surprised because, you know, I know Steve is playing Street Fighter Six real heavy. Yep. So I didn't know whether he had time to practice or whatnot, but you know, hey, you know, if you're good, you're good. I mean that's yeah. what it just boils down to, you know? Exactly. It's it's win or die in tournament setting. Damn, yeah. picking our characters fast as hell. I wonder wow. if this Hydran is going to be first. Now nah, put the Ralph first. I want to see the Ralph. Give me oh, the Ralph. He's about it. He's about it. Give me the Ralph. No, 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 Give me the Ralph. No, 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 no. I knew it. I knew it. He's gonna do it first. He's like, nah, we need to finish this. I want the I want the Ralph. <laughs> I want the Ralph. Chino's funny. Uh, he's, he's, cool. he's a cool guy. He's very cool guy. It's about to be a party up in here. <laughs> he's also like ridiculous. I don't know if, if the people here have seen the losers final set he had against F Kang. Uh, absolutely ridiculous. Yes. The things he does. Yeah. That man is on a different level. Also in his forties. <laughs> yeah. If you, if you think you're ready. too old to continue playing Round fighting one. games, ready? these players are here to prove it wrong. Yeah. Oh man, it is. Oh god, I don't want to hear the song. No. <laughs> Come Panic. On. Come on, this is like a Street Fighter song. No. <laughs> I'd rather listen to Indestructible on repeat. 
You're yeah. absolutely right. <laughs> yeah, you know you're right. Oh god. Every everyone who's ever sat in training mode for more than ten minutes has PTSD for this song. Oh yeah, you, you can tell they try to go like a shoot by the three, like with Jazz yeah. and Tom. Yeah. <laughs> oh what a neutral bro. Bro, the full jump and the neutral jump this weekend have been ridiculous. Oh, the cross up. Oh my god. That's disgusting. Give me your blood. Do it again. I actually have no no uh, no idea how much damage Stormbreaker does. I think it's like 100 exactly. Yeah. Woo! Two B! Ba -ba -ba. Oh, you need to finish this, man. Oh, no, he you miss it. it. Yo. Oh, he's fishing. Throw a fireball! Do it! The extra cut! Whoa, he's out of there! <laughs> There's a fireball! Stop. Oh, 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 the time's going down. Eight. Oh! Six seconds. Woo! Oh. Yo, the fuck is this? Ah! He's gonna jump. If he what just, is going just on? Wait, just wait. He has to wait. Oh, he get it. Oh, there we go. Oh. Yo, he took that down to time? Yo, we got timeouts in this exhibition? This is ridiculous. <laughs> oh, here we go. Give some of that life back. Give some of that life. Oh, yeah. To the front. Oh, lockdown. Depression. To the corner. Oh, nice. Oh! That went the other way. Ooh. That was an opening right there. Yeah, Seth got, got lucky with that one. This set is already chaotic as hell. Yeah, I know. Yo, the Clark though. The Clark put in put put in work in top eight. Yeah. Chino was guessing right on all cylinders. The Clark is just waiting for that. One opportunity to start to get things going. Yo, he are it's just close. You can't even find a way in. Oh, oh there, there it is. Go. Oh, no. We're in Speaking of can't find a way in, he is in. He is in there. Yeah, he's got to keep her in. There. Oh, no. The guard cancel rollback was so smart. Yeah. All right, we're back to neutral setting. Sace more than willing to keep this space, oh. but it didn't matter. Air to air. Oh, nice. he just jumped! Nice he's read. dead off of this if he spends two. Oh, he's dead off of this if he spends one, but yeah, that works. Yeah. Kill and that I, character. Yeah, that was the right call to do. And just deal with the route. Absolutely. Yeah. I'm personally not dealing with Clark ever again. Kill it. Oh, yeah. Destroy Ooh. that character. Alright, but the Ralph still very strong on Chino's side. Also put in a lot of work in top eight. Oh, nice over there. Another overhead. Oh man, says so is playing around. Overheads unlocked. It is 10:30 at night. Learn to block. Ooh. I'm surprised he didn't cancel that. He's typically good with that. Yes, he is. Ooh, what a micro walk forward. Oh, guard him. Oh, you're oh, dead. Yeah, you died. Ba -ba. No, Whoa. he did the exit. Why did you do the EX tumble kicks or whatever the hell it's called? Yeah, you probably have the frame part. Yeah. Oh, this is not good. Oh, all right, far C works. 30 seconds left, so he's going to get the second highest amount of HP back. But Cronin uh, will kill you on the next hit. Off of me. It's our generation. <laughs> <laughs> no, he's gonna punish and he died! Oh, That's man. great! Goodbye! Got blown away. Chino. That was a nail biter. Chino was uh up. was all was risking it top uh, top eight on some of those uh heavy gaddling attacks. So you know not surprising he went for it here. But that will be the end of our not exhibition. That will. Oh, okay, okay. So now comes the, I guess the real part of the exhibition. Yes. So now it's Pokemon style. Winter stays on. Uh, the previous matches were just so everyone got a chance to play on stream because, yep. uh, because any of these players could just come up and just cook for five characters straight. Yep. I think uh, the one to do it would probably be uh, a few choice names: uh, Rockling Keo.
Chino, Weto, F Kang, yeah. just to name a few of who can just cook and keep cooking. Yeah. And I mean, they seem awake. Kusa definitely seems awake. He got like three one, just one hit supers in that set. That was ridiculous. And I'm not awake enough for this. <laughs> that was ridiculous. Even I didn't see that coming. Yeah, so here we go. We're about to go all out. Who is up? Yuri Kov. Who are you sending Ooh. up? Ooh. We, now we got. All right. We got well, our. Those are some great <laughs> exhibition matches, don't you think? But, you know, there's a, there's a saying dear to my heart that I feel like resonates with a lot of people. The first one didn't count. And I sneeze, or the light was in my eyes. See, let's, let's run it back. So, they've decided to go ahead and run it back Pokemon style. Team Mexico versus Team Peru. Team Mexico has decided to send up Gummy, and Team Peru sends up Yurikov. Ooh. Let's get to it. <laughs> he, he hit the finger gun. He hit the finger guns on stream. But yes, Yurikov versus Gummy. Coming up next, Pokemon style winner stays on. Was he yawning? Was Yurikov yawning? He might be tired. It, it's EP time. It is 10:30 now, officially at night. Yep. I don't even know what this is like. First to what? First to five? First to ten? I guess we'll see. Oi. They're just making the rules up on the fly. N next, we're gonna start calling in substitutions. <laughs> uh, we're about to play like here. KOF 11. <laughs> that, that's what I'm about to see. We're about to play KOF 11. We should play KOF 2000 so everyone has their own striker. Oh, Lord. <laughs> I'm trying to see the Joe striker. <laughs> Round one. Ready? Game Go. one. Uh -huh. Wow. <laughs> Just do it. Yo, over the 2D, off of me, a flash kick hit both sides. Oh my god, this guy is so big shit. Nice punish! There we go. Gummy staying Ooh. on his toes with that one. Wow, oh, wow. He, he patiently waited to hit the fattest CD ever. He was like, bro, he did. Down back, walk back, and he just let it rip. Like the thickest CD ever. Get oh, out of the sky. On the ground. Met and Clint Airwaves lift, lifting off. That CD's so bad. Yeah. That CD's ridiculous, bro. Why does he extend like a like a the flailing tube man that you see at those car dealerships? You know what I'm talking about. Kill him. Spend two bars. No. No DP. Oh, no DP. Yeah. Those full jumps, I look at them, I'm like, man, that's so scary to do. Yoinky Spoinky could be on deck, doesn't need to throw. And, we're tied up. and we are indeed tied up, Max Powers. Thank you. Three bars on the Luong. Ooh, blocks. Literally almost last time. I mean, this is this is the character Yuri Cop cooked with last time, right? Yeah. Like, like straight cook, like Matt and Cook did nothing. Yui. Close D, close D again. Oh, oh Yoinky, God. Spoinky. Tried to get the second one, oh, didn't work so out. Oh, no nice cancer. drop. Oh, it gets another chance. Spend it. Yeah, Yoinky, Spoinky. Not enough to kill, guess. Ooh, ooh, wow. The trade actually what? That's what I traded. Okay. Player two has victory in their sights. That's nuts. Yo, five bars on the on the Jenny. That's my queen right there. Jenny for the block. I got I got I got Jenny. Ah, oh, you got open up and you're dead. You're absolutely dead. Yeah, he's got this. Well, no, he can EX. EX kill. No. You can EX it. Man, he should be fine as long as he doesn't take the way out of time. Too, too many risks. I mean, Harrier is always a good choice. Harrier plus. 
Not oh. that one, though. You missed the third kick. And you just took half your health. Not like this. He's trying to get those Harriers. There's a third one. That's the... Oh, my oh, God. Oh, what a super. It's not looking good. Oh, Yo, he that. hit him out of Okay, okay. He hit him out of EX Harrier. He might be on one. Okay. Jenny. Jenny back. Default color, Jenny. Never seen that a day in my life. <laughs> it's, this is going to be the matchup, huh? That's what I'm going to watch. Just two people find a, trying, to, trying to find ways to harrier one another. Ooh. Air to air. Nice block on the cross up. Still three bars on the side of Yuri Cobb. Can even it up on any stray hit confirm. Oh, I like that one. Uh, uh. All right, save. Okay. Didn't want to save jump, I guess. Gives Gummy the corner. Kill. Nice crack shoot. Oh, oh the overhead. Oh, oh, oh. 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 Questionable, uh, qu questionable decisions coming up at the end minor. there. Maybe up. spelling the end for Yuri Kov. And now, who do we have, or who do coming you think? Coming up next, we got Ooh. Dante replacing. Absolutely. <laughs> they were like, nah, bro, we got to go. Dante immediately coming up to the stage. Yeah, just a couple bad decisions can really spell the end there. Yeah. He didn't go for the safe jump, and then when he tried to run forward or jump forward, he just gave Gummy corner control. Definitely not something you want to do against a character like Jenny, especially when you are Jenny. <laughs> You know what can happen. Plus frames out the wazoo. Select members. Put all your skills to the test. And show I still don't even know what this is first to. They, they just could play all night. Honestly, given the opportunity, I know these players. It's fair. Is it? <laughs> they definitely, definitely don't have enough rules. But, first to five, maybe. Can we go nine games? Or I guess like 15, if you count the, the first five matches, or 14. All right. The Joe coming back. The Rio coming back. Dante is up and ready to go. All right, getting into our next set. Let's see if Gummy can extend the lead to two game or uh, two straight wins. Nothing will stop this show. We actually have, uh, from what I see, from my perspective, because uh, I can see the crowd directly in front of me. <laughs> we actually have a pretty sizable crowd watching the exhibition, which is nice. Yeah. Especially for uh, this late night, 10.30. People might Saturday. be Saturday. Yeah, I know, right? Ready? People could be out getting crunk right now. Yeah. Not us, though. We're watching some high-level KOF. D-Gen hours is all you need to see some of the best Latin American players face off here at CEO 2023. Ooh. What a roll forward. Oh, no. I'm not gonna lie to you. This Yashua color is mid. <laughs> it's mid. Oh, he got the JA though! It's alright, I made him angry. Hey. Oh. So mid is slapping right now. I know. Ooh. No, no cancel. Oh. Yo, his third leg, see? Right there. He saw the hit spark of that third leg. Oh, man. One of the gre greatest cross-up normals in this game. Oh my god. Boom, boom. Bop, bop. 
that cat is so good. Oh. No, yeah, you get a big punish off of that. Spend, spend, spend one. Yeah. Boy, the JD, nice throw. Realized he probably wasn't that plus or plus at all. Oh my god! Ate him alive off of that low, low hop DP. Jesus. The level 2 immediately afterwards. Gummy evening it up. Oh, wow, he got caught. Empty jump again. Oh. Alright, he's not gonna get a lot. Spends it all, though. What? He may, may have tried to do EX2 and 4 BD. Oh no, he tried to stand the anti-air, didn't work. And you're dead. No meter needed. It's gummy cooking regardless. So good. Damn, Corona. Very good right now. Gummy's really holding it down. So you know, he's looking to close this out and, you know, help this team get it too well. Yeah, he had machine gun punches. Should only need one, well, level one to kill. It should be enough. Never mind, this character might suck. What a mix! Caught him sleeping at the wheel off of that, uh, off of the parry cancel there. And now we got the DJ coming out. Jenny coin. Oh, full health. Dante with the leader advantage. Sitting on three stacks. Three stacks for Rio is a lot. That's a lot of damage to be had. Question is who's gonna open up. Oh, he almost got a crossover. Yo, the jab. The KOS special stand jab anti air. And they look dope every time. Ooh. Oh, you, you're dead, by the way. Yeah, you died. Uh, yeah, you should be dead. Because you go boing, boing, and then you get a DP. No, I forgot he doesn't get DP. I forgot it's the other way around, level 1 to level 2. Oh, EX cancel? No, doesn't need it. Cross up. Nice rollout. This is going to happen. Do we get a comeback of the century? I believe in coming. Yo! Coming! He can level one cancel off of this. Is he dead? No, no way! Gummy. With the clutch. Holy crap. Unbelievable. Gummy is on no fire right now. No way. Ross Clot. No way. The choice of routing there, not to spend on EX machine gun punches and just do raw level two super. Coming up yeah, next to fight the beast, nice. we have Kusa. Oh my God, bro. That was ridiculous. <laughs> just enough gummy scrapes it. That's insane, bro. I can't. Oh. Yep, so. Speaking of a man who could do it, the man who is just one hit confirming DPs into supers and stand normals into supers, Kusa coming up to the stage. Team Mexico on a tear right now. Gummy two straight. They're saving their uh, they're saving their big guns for last with Rockland Keo and Chino Funky. I, so what I've seen from this bracket so far yeah. is the longer your tag is, the more powerful you are. <laughs> you got Rockland Keo, you got Chino Funky, you got Wedo Asamiya. Mm -hmm. You just add more letters and you gain more power. That's, that's it. <laughs> All right, getting into our third set here of this Pokemon style. Winner stays on. Kusa looking to cook. I can hear someone's buttons from here. I can hear someone pressing their buttons from here. <laughs> We're like 30 feet away from the stage and I can hear that. Yo, Kusa with a one button hit confirms. He might be, he might be smoking one. Ooh. 
decides to go for far D. I've never seen Yasuo act actively press that normal for any reason. You're going nowhere though, says Gummy. Nice block on the cross up setup. Or side twitch setup, I should say. Stay in the corner. Gets for your life. Oh, what an answer. What he, did, he didn't even like, he was buffering that. Like, he sure was. Th that was the one like string that uh, Kusa canceled into heavy dash punch. He was just buffering DP. He said, free me. He's cracked, bro. I don't get it. He's just different. He's just different. Oh, and he's doing it again. So Just yeah, stay, oh. stay down. Nice oh, to get out of the corner. What the Wow, TV? what a sweep on the phone. DP. Oh, what a word. Oh, where's the DP on that? The one? back dash there may have messed it up. It's all good. Yeah. Chip damage will kill. JD air to air, and we're evened up. Who is this man, bro? Who is this man? He's cooking. Now we got the Cronin. Sitting on three bars. Oh, man. Oh. All right, the Cronin is in now. Well, no, no punish on the roll. Yo, the empty jump. Oh, here we go. The empty dead. Doesn't the spend. Bar. Yeah, next he'll kill. Just foot seeing it up right now. Yo, he, he read the back dash. Yeah, he knew he loved to back dash after strings like that, so he just ran at him. And I mean, Rio definitely doesn't have the fastest back dash. Yeah, Gummy's on his, on his, really on his way of taking out Kusa and his what team on Rio Lee. And it's looking like that, right? You like the Splanky? I always forget about that cross-up setup because it looks so jank. Oh, big damage. Oh, yeah. Alright, I like that, I like that. Oh, he blocked the overhead. Went right into quick mode. Meter lacking on the side of Kusa now. Yeah, he's looking very good. He's got to spend one bar here to kill. Oh. Why does that always work? Like genuinely, like every time Akio kills with that, he's like mad far out, like straight tip 6B range, and it always hits. You always take the boot to the mouth. I don't get it. Like there's gotta be something in the water. Guess for game. Get hit by a far C, just a raw far C. Well, Kusa's gonna have to try to pull this off because Punish. Oh, you're so dead. That is the game. Should keep it simple. Spend the bar. Gummy! Three games straight. On a tear right now. All eyes are on the He got Kusa so upset right now. Yeah. So. He's out of there, bro. He's out of there. Now Team Rock. Mexico pulls ahead 3-0. <laughs> Can Baru make a comeback? Here comes Rock Lane Kyo. So this is so this is funny because I don't know if y'all heard the way Duang said that. Um, but last year at CEO, when we did uh, a Mexico versus Brazil exhibition, Mexico cooked like 90% of Brazil. Mm. Uh, and then FKN came up and actually gave them some games. But it was like, it was a wash. Like it was a one-sided wash. Mm. Uh, and his tone right there reminded me just of that. Like the other team that's not Mexico is just getting washed. <laughs> but I mean, you have the two, some of the two best players in this top eight of Rockland Keo and Chino Funky sitting in the wings. Rockland Keo up to the stage right now. <laughs> The Benny Maru and the Shunie. The Benny Maru is cooking everybody. He plays that character like no one I've ever seen. The headphones go on. Gummy's like, I don't need no headphones. I need no sound. He's got square glasses. <laughs> Oh, 
All right, fourth set here of this exhibition for the Pokemon side, anyways. Did have five sets earlier if you want to go watch those when this is done. But yes, fourth fourth set of this Pokemon <laughs> exhibition. Rockling Keo Ready? versus Gummy. Let's get it. Jesus, what an anti-air. No! Just love the way he says it. No! All right, corner control to Rockling Keo. Whoa, what a JP. Oh, off of him, though. Oh. Yo, the air to air trade. Punish! That is so big right now for Gummy. Yo, what a hit confirm. The low profile anti air, even game. But I mean, Rock. Oh, ah! I was gonna say, Rockling Kyo isn't scared to command grab you, and then he just raw DPs. He's not scared. He's not scared. Just do it. Never afraid. Gummy up a character. Low health on the Chizuru. Definitely doable by the Shun EA. Oh, that's a bar. I actually have never seen him Shatter Strike today. So that was actually really surprising to see him do that just now. Oh man, the movement. Bro, that's that's my best part about watching Rock and Keo is just the, the air options he chooses for neutral just astounds me. Yo, Gummy though? This is the meaty. Yo, what a catch on the roll. Cross the sofa. Oh, smash, yeah, you can't, you can't. Yeah, 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 yeah. A lot of uh, a lot of Latin American players have definitely been good about mashing on some clone setups like that. That'll that'll catch you off guard and catch you sleeping. Half health on the Shunie though. The teacher did put in a bit of work. Oh, I thought that was the opening right there. Rocking his keeping him at bay. Yo, oh, there's the DP. Yo, the, the jab. I, I love that Abare option with the dash fire fist. Oh, nice. Not dead. Guess for game, though. Oh, he's, oh, he's not dead, though. No. Set up. Oh, I thought he actually had a setup off of that. I wanted to see something cheeky. Baited the EX blue hand. Still has another EX blue hand. Double. Double KO. Oh, we are close. We are close. Wow. Uh, I've only seen like one other double KO this weekend. Ready? Oh, the only problem is Gummy got four bars. Four bars, bro. And we've seen him make a comeback with Jenny with less help. Oh, there you go, Rockland. Nice anti air with the Rekka. Ooh, that was pussy. Oh, he lost some good damage. All right, guess for game. Yes, yeah, Scum Gale does not kill. Oh, That's so sad. much damage. Okay, so you're eating like 70% for this, uh, and then she still has two bars. So basically, good luck. Hey! Yeah. All right, guess for game. Doesn't bite on the Harriers. 2D traded. You got it, EX. No, he didn't EX. Taco hit, but it didn't work. Tell me he's getting away with murder. Yes, Harry does not catch the back dash. Oh, oh yeah. yeah. And Rockland finally the thrown dummy. He almost took that four up. Rockland. His defense at the end was really good from Rockland Keo. And that anti air, that run up anti air. Good stuff. What a well earned victory. Coming up next for Team Mexico, we have Sace MX. Really? They're just putting Sace up there. Damn. Yeah. All right. Peru finally on the board with one. After Gummy's three win streak, Sace coming up to fight Rockling Keo. Mm -hmm. We are now going into the 11th hour of the, what's 
today? The 24th day <laughs> of the June month, or however they say it in the old scriptures. I am unsure, but we are here. DGen Hours KOF. Thank you for tuning in to twitch.tv slash funky P, or I guess if you're on YouTube uh, at Data FGC. Um, thank you for tuning in and watching some KOF. If you haven't, when this is over, go back and watch the KOF Top 8 VOD from earlier this morning. But for now, we have many more games to be played. We're, we're strapping in to be here at least for another hour if Rocklin Keo uh, continues his win streak. Select stage. They just went to the arena. They were talking about it. They had to talk about stage picks. We're gonna become like Smash. We're gonna Get start banning stuff. <laughs> where's my where's my strike and ban like iPad? Where I can press the button and put the giant X on the stage that someone made. <laughs> I'm just gonna put X on concert hall every time. <laughs> Absolutely not. That's your, that's the uh that's that's one of the stages you don't like. Yeah, that's, a, that's the counter pick. Oh, okay. I I go on there and then I and then I uh, climax and all the frames drop on the PS4. Oh yeah, that's right. You're absolutely right about that. <laughs> Yo, what a wake up mash! He's not a bar and he is just mashing. All your favorite top players are mashers. Yeah, he's pressing all the right buttons. Oh, CD whiffs. Even game though. No DP. What an immediate press! Ha! The stand jab to beat the CD! Guess for game, EX Command Grab kills. He wanted it! Woo! Yeah, where are you pressing? Fire. You gotta press it, definitely. Yeah. Ooh, she tried to like short hop J, uh, JD again. And now there was a right, definitely the right call. Kind of like hold it down. Yeah. Ready? Go. They have a character theme together, Benny and Chizuru. What the? I didn't even know that. I didn't know that either. Do they have beef? Is it is it because she's on? She's with Iori and Kyo, and he's not. Yo, what a super! For some reason, the overlay changed. <laughs> I can barely see the health. It's fine. 300 health left. Nice back dash on the command grab. I don't need to see the health. I just know that he's dead. <laughs> I mean, at the end of the day, he's just dead. There we go. Ooh. He did Shatter Strike again. Yeah, they want that pressure. Now Rockland don't stop flying all over the place like Peter Pan. <laughs> like Peter Pan. <laughs> nice patient. Ooh, Yo. nice. Catches the tech, another throw in your face. Oh! Try to go for the low, the anime low. Baited out a Shatter Strike with that. Nice usage of the blue hand. Oh, hey, nice. Shatter Strike. Nice. Boom, fist. Rockland is doing really well. And he's going to really help his team get get back in shape. All he has to do is get through this prone in and uh, they on their way to becoming 3-2. Cronin's gonna be hard though. Three and a half bars. Can probably kill with just half a bar. Yeah. But I mean, the way things are going, he's trying to lay now. But he got it. Yeah. Kills with half a bar. Almost four bars on the Cronin. Iori gonna come in with just under three. This is a slobber knocker. Yes, it is. He's gonna hit him with a taco eventually in this. In this. He's gonna hit him with a taco. 
I don't know when it's gonna happen, but I feel it in my bones. Wow, what up QC, just like that. Close whiff, like close C whiff, but like not on frame kill timing. Explosion. Guess for game? Oh, he's dead. He actually built meter, Jesus. That's crazy. That was insane. Now I mean, it's 4 one. one. Yeah? I mean, the comeback was made with the Cronin. So potentially uh, exhibition point coming up for Team Mexico. And there's one man standing in the way of that. Your second place. All right, we got Peru's last hope. Chino Funky. Still wearing the medal he got for Can getting second it? place. Let's see. At, or during top eight. The man potentially to run it all back with the Clark. Uh, the Clark of uh, centuries. The Clark of uh, several dimensions because he's always thinking ahead. He's got all the timelines going on. He's like Doctor Strange. <laughs> I mean, it kind of sucks that Chino got all this pressure now. He got to yeah. do all this. He's got to run it four straight. And then worry about Rayro at the end. Yeah. Well, Bueno Which... sitting atop the throne. It's kind of like the intro to Mortal Kombat Armageddon. It's like sitting atop the throne. He's got to go through f Kang as well if he did, does beat Sace. So uh, he's got a lot on his plate. And it's 11 p.m. And we're old men. Uh, not me, all of you, though. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> old man, it's, it's bedtime. Be up in here. And then who knows when their flights are? They could be leaving tomorrow. Yeah. But let's get it. Your fifth, fifth. Can I count fifth? Yeah, it's fifth. <laughs> fifth set coming up here in the exhibition. One, Ralph ready? in the driver's seat yeah. for Chino. <laughs> Sace looking to end it early. What a hit confirm. Yeah, EXDP back. Ooh. He's trying to utilize that far C. Yeah, he's not scared to press it. And I mean, it's a very good button. Especially on air counter hit, because it leaves you in that juggle state on, on counter hit. But kill, ready to do some damage. Boom. Nice throw tech. Yo, the 2C gets beat now, get picked up, guess for game, overhead does kill. Not gonna use it though, gonna keep it real safe, get 2 would in your mouth. Ooh, rising JB to beat out the preemptive jump. He JB'd for his life like he knew it was coming. Clark finally here to put in some work. Wow. Yo, what a hit confirm. All right, he's dead. Box five. Boing, rolling death cradle. Doesn't even use it. Use that funky throw that no Clark ever uses except when it kills. Still <laughs> unsure exactly why he has it, but here yeah. we are. Literally, <laughs> no reason to use it. Does less damage than rolling death cradle. Doesn't give you any Oki. Nope. Nice J A air to air. That was neutral hop. Yeah, he's waiting. Oh, oh wow! Yo, right in her mouth. If he had canceled that, I would have lost my shit. Oh, you can't roll. You can't roll tech there. Overhead. Yo, Sace in control. Sace in control. Overhead. Overhead. Whoa! Whoa, what a read. What a read. The jump to backdash. Gets the roll. Hydern, the only thing stopping from Mexico from potentially taking this exhibition. Chapa. Slicer. Uh, Hydern definitely can do it. I think Chino's easily his best character. After, especially after the things we've seen at Combo Breaker. Shout out to Chino versus Rylander. If you haven't seen that set. 
Oh my god, you're gonna get put in jail though. Oh no. He decides to not jail it up. Guess for game. Overhead. Throw. Overhead. Oh, he's in there. It says. Throw overhead. Just like that. Not a question. Oh yeah, they're, they're all up, they're all up. I think that spells the end of this exhibition for tonight. Mexico taking it 5-1 over Peru. Yep. A chance to, a chance for the uh, opposing country to try and make it closer, but uh, shades of Mexico for uh, versus Brazil from a year ago. If anyone remembers that, I mean, I commentated it, so I gotta remember it. <laughs> uh, but yeah, that will, I think, conclude uh, your exhibition for the night. Yeah. I have no one telling me no, so I'm gonna go with my own train of thought. Yeah, <laughs> yeah they're gonna yeah. take a, a quick picture with all the players. Shout outs to, um, I mean, all the Latin American players that came out to yep. CEO this year. Uh, shout outs to everyone watching at home right now. Look at that. Look at that, nice camera shot. We got production. We have the money for that. Weto looks like he's ready to go to bed. He looks cozy, bro. He ain't even break a sweat. <laughs> he didn't have to do a damn thing. Katsune got the nice, oh, those ripped pants. Man, is styling. He's got Tims on? Are those Tims? Yeah. Yo, Caribbean Tims? They might be different. <laughs> they might be different. Yeah. They might have like thin bottoms. So, this concludes our exhibi exhibition for Peru versus Mexico. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And I'd like to, you know, give a round of applause to our exhibitioners. They did, they put on a great show. Ooh, look at that feedback, I like that. We don't have any medals. Whoever <laughs> made top eight, all you already got your medals. Stand there and look pretty. <laughs> but yeah, I wanna shout out to the Latin Americans who came out uh, to CEO yeah, to compete. Uh, I'm sad that uh, Fernicius could not make it out. I think Fernicius is going to Toriukin instead. But uh, shout out to Fernicius if you do watch this or end up watching this or whatever. Um, but yeah, shout outs to everyone watching right now. This exhibition, shout outs. Yeah, shout outs to uh, all the people who competed in KOF this weekend. It was actually really good. I was actually really surprised with the turnout yeah. uh, and the amount of players who showed up and competed, especially with Combo Breaker just being last month. So it's a hard decision financially, definitely. The only reason I can do it is because I live here. <laughs> I would not be able to do both tournaments oh, back to back if I didn't live privilege. here. Yeah, I know. Privilege to live in Florida, huh? Yeah. <laughs> yeah I don't know about that one. I don't know about that one. Uh, that's funny, but, but yeah, I mean, honestly, you know, this was a great weekend. I enjoy, of course, always uh, doing ETL for King of Fighters 15. It's always an amazing, uh, amazing experience. Commentators always do a good job. Players come out and show out. You know, um, I just hope that hopefully in the near future the SK really takes into consideration and giving us more for the players because the players do really put a lot of time and energy yeah. uh, and dedication to this. And you know, uh, it's a great game. Yeah. Like I, I really, there's no complaints. I know it's difficult. It's very, very, uh, uh, you know, intense game, but yeah. I just feel like, you know, if there's a way that we could be able to start getting some more stuff going, you know, yeah. I think that we can have a SNK much larger... World Championship when? Yes. Let us when? know when, please. They yeah. are, they already, like, teased it, though, like, months ago. Yeah. Like, so. almost a year ago. Yeah, so SNK, hey, yeah, you know. What, what? Is this the picture? Is this the picture we got of the players? Oh, that's amazing. Oh, that's hold a on. nice shot. Eh. Nice I'm, shot not, I'm not tall enough for this. There you go. Look at that. Ooh. All right, let me not drop your phone. That's not my phone. That's more money than my phone is worth. Oh. <laughs> oh, they got us. In Wait, the back they got too. us in the back. Oh, we're uh, we're like. The yeah, the extended family. We're like back <laughs> home on the Zoom call. But yes, uh, shout outs to everyone watching. Shout outs yeah, to uh, Data FGC. Yes. For putting this whole thing yeah, on. Thank you. Thank shout outs to the man, Marco, a.k.a. Kraken, uh, for coming up with this. Yeah, like, shout outs to you. Yep. I'm calling you out on the uh, on the mic. Uh, he was uh, one half of Climax uh, of Night, for those who don't know. Shout outs to him. Shout outs to the entire Data team. Shout outs to Virgo for being game lead and giving me uh, the chance to MC Top 8 earlier today. And it was a privilege to see you up there. <laughs> it was, uh, was nerve-wracking. 
Shout outs to all the Latin Americans. Shout outs to all the KOF players. Shout outs to everyone at home. But uh, that is going to be it for us tonight here on Funky P at CEO. Yep. Virgo, it's been a pleasure. Yeah. And we will catch y'all in the morning uh, for Undernight here. Yep. And that would be.